am very excited to be here. I am originally from Wales and I still have a little bit of my accent. And I also grew up for my uh, elementary age schooling in Africa, in Nairobi. Uh, I came to uh, America almost 30 years ago now. I'm married uh, to my wife, Lynn. We've been married for 22 years. And we have one daughter, her name is Keris, and uh, she's a sophomore in high school. When I was a child, I wanted to be a firefighter and I went into education actually and uh, working with children. Then I saw an opportunity in St. Louis Park to become a part-time firefighter. Probably the first couple of weeks of training uh, I was like, you know what, this was what I was meant to do and uh, so pretty soon I had quit my job and gone full-time in the fire department and here I am 20 years later. I've been a mountain guide, a high altitude mountain guide, for about 20 years now. There are some really close similarities in the skill set that we use as mountain guides that we use in the fire department. Being a, a high altitude mountain guide has taught me how to be a fire chief in a hazardous situation. I was sitting in the back of the fire engine frantically running through my medical training, trying to remember what I needed to do on this call. The two people in the front of the fire truck, the officer and the driver, who were very experienced, were calmly talking about whose turn it was to cook dinner that night. And the juxtaposition between my near panic and their calmness talking about dinner very, struck me in the moment as, you know, why aren't they worked up about this? Why is it just me? And that's just experience because I'm now that person arguing about dinner in the front of the truck and the rookies were in the back worrying about it. That's just part of the transition um, from rookie to experienced firefighter. Connect on a deeper level with the community. This is their fire department. We're here every day, all day, 24-7, all year long and so we're available to the community. So we want to be there for your events. We want to be there for your kids. Um, not just in times of emergency, but other times when you need us around. This is the pinnacle of my career. Uh, I am going to do everything I can to make the Egan Fire Department one that you're proud of and that you get to interact with. We're here for you, we're here to serve, and, uh, and I will do my best while I'm here to make that happen. I'm excited to be here and uh, I look forward to meeting you.